What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon X walkthrough. Oh, I'm ready for this one. Feeling pumped up. The music's got it. Oh, yeah, I love this music. I really do. They really did a good job with the legendary music. So, in our last episode, we went through all of Team Flare, including Lysandre, and we beat pretty much all the admins to get to this point right here in front of Xerneas, the legendary fairy type Pokemon of Kalos. So what we're going to be doing right now is we're going to try and capture this guy. Hopefully not defeat it because that would be bad. And well, look at that Mega Horn. And wow. That Pokemon is going to be very strong. So here comes another Mega Horn. Oh my god. All right. Let's do this. I, I'm, I'm just telling you this right now. The music is really, really hardcore. I love it. <sighs> Let's go. Kakashi Hitake. Let's get this. Alrighty. Let's go with the Nereal Ace. Now, the, the plan is right here is not to make this Pokemon faint. We're trying to capture this guy. And, oh, crud. It's powering up. Let's do this again, Aerial Ace. Come on, Kakashi. Alrighty, and here comes it's Geo Mansisi Michichi Mintrichi, and uh -oh. that right there it raised its attack and special attack and everything else in between. Good God! Okay, here we go, Aerial Ace again, and here comes its Spirit Bomb or Moon Blast, and that right there took us out. Oh my God! Okay, you're, you're not making it that easy, okay? Let's do this, Goku. Alrighty. I may have chosen the wrong Pokemon for this one. I probably did. Okay. So what I'm going to do right now is I'm actually going to try and capture it. I do have enough Pokeballs to try and capture it. Plus, in this game, this legendary Pokemon is not that hard to capture. It's just, you know, it's a, it's a matter of when to capture it. And there's one. There's two. There's three. Come on, stay in the ball. Yes! Throwing out that peace sign. What's up, guys? So I got myself a Xerneas. Oh, yes. Like I said, it's a very easy Pokemon to capture. Xerneas, the life Pokemon. Fairy type Pokemon, 9 feet 10 inches, 474 pounds of pure muscle. Legends say it, it can share eternal life. It's left for thousands of years in the form of a tree before its revival. And, well, I'm not going to name it at all. And after that, it's going to ask you, do you want to add uh, Xerneas to your party? Yes, I do. Just for this one special occasion, I am going to actually switch out one of my Pokemon right here. I think the Pokemon that needs to be switched is, for right now, it's going to be Bonesaw right here. Alrighty. Yes, I'm sending Bonesaw back for just this one pur purpose right here. What a relief! Now they can't use the ultimate weapon. You're amazing, Sensei! A legendary Pokemon wanting to be your friend like that? It's unbelievable! What a, star what a startling development! I never would have thought that you were really the chosen one. Huh? Oh damn, it's Bionic Lissandre. Oh crud. So this is the mighty Xerneas. I expected more from a Pokemon called a legend. You desire help from people? You need help from a human. Wait, wait, wait. What's going on with that with that outfit? Is that really you, Lissandre? Or whatever? Sensei! Already or Sensei already beat you. What are you doing here? For me, victory is using the ultimate weapon. In order to do that, I need to reclaim the legendary Pokemon's power and send it to the weapon once again. I'll be taking the legendary Pokemon back now. This time, I won't lose. I too shall use the Mega Ring and Mega Stone that you researched during your travels. Oh damn. So here we go guys, another battle, final battle, and he's got himself a mega ring right here. Oh damn, Bionic Lissandre, ready to take us on. He's actually ready for a duel, he's more ready for a duel than a freaking battle right here. And, well, our first Pokemon up is going to be Xerneas. Okay, alrighty, let's get this. Let's go with the Mega, Her mega Horn, and here comes that high jump kick. Not so effective. Mega Horn. Bam. Not super effective. I completely forgot that fighting type Pokemon are, are weak. So let's go again with the uh, well high jump kick. We're getting kicked. Here we go. Mega Mega Blast or more Moon Blast. 
Super effective. Suck on those lemons, my chow. Yeah, buddy. Okay, alrighty. So he's gonna be coming out with a hunch crow. You know what? I'm gonna continue on right here. Because uh, Hunchcrow is a dark type Pokemon. It is uh, weak against his Moonblast. So here we go again. Moonblast for the win. That's right, Hunchcrow. You had nothing. Nothing. Yeah, buddy. And Kakashi Hitake at level 59. Here he comes out with the Pyroar. I'm gonna go straight for the man, the myth, the legend, Kakashi Hitake. Alrighty. Let's go. Okay, alrighty. Let's see what's going on right here. Let's go right ahead and go with the Surf Attack. Alrighty, okay. Look at that. Okay, look at that. And, uh, well, not so strong after all. So he's going to be coming out with his Gyarados. It's time, guys. It's time to use Flip Bolt once more time here. But this time, we're going to be doing... The most important thing, we're gonna Mega Evolve this guy to its ultimate power. And here comes its Gyarados, looking all mean to intimidate us and all that crud. But guess what, we're not physical attackers. We're gonna do Mega Evolution and the Power Gem. This guy, Mega Evolving into the big ass shrimp that he is. Oh damn. Look at that, Mega Shrimp. Gyarados, looking all mean. So here we go, Mega Evolution. Let's get it! Fluffolt Digivolve to Mega Fluffolt. Look at the majestic hair on that guy. Look at that. Alrighty. And it got the mold breaker breaking the mold and crap baskets on a crapsicle stick. Good gravy. Okay, so here we go. Power jump. Damn it, not so strong. Okay. So we might have uh, screwed up a little. <laughs> we screwed up badly. Ah, uh, balls. So that was a crappy way of uh, that was a crappy way of Mega evolving our Pokemon. <laughs> All right, Xerneas, let's do this. Maximum effort. All right, you can't do anything with that uh, outrage. So let's go right ahead and use that Moonblast for the win. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> oh my God. Oh my god. Uh, well, there it is. He is done. Oh my god. It's over. Fools with no vision will continue to befoul this beautiful world. They will go on until the only thing left to do is squabble over the remaining scraps of hope. Yes. That's right. I'm yelling. I'm like, yeah. Suck it, Lissandre. <laughs> oh, damn. Oh, damn. He's going crazy. Um, you know what I think? Even the even if there's only a little bit of some things, it's still best to share it. Even you managed to use Mega Evolution. That's because Gyarados shared its power with you, didn't it? And not just Gyarados, but your other Pokemon too. Oh damn. The legendary Pokemon is gone, so you can't use the ultimate weapon anymore, right? You don't have to worry about the future by your all by yourself. I think everyone should work together to make a better, beautiful world. If that were possible, all wars would have been ended long ago. I can only see one future. One where selfish, foolish humans think about nothing other than themselves and steal more and more from one another. It's a tragic future. The original purpose of this device was to bring a Pokemon back to life. But the Ancient King transformed it into the ultimate weapon. <laughs> when the legendary Pokemon awakened, it took back much of its energy, its power, that had been sent to the ultimate weapon. There's not much left, but there is enough to use it at once. Ah, oh damn! It's driving Sycamore's pupils. Let us live forever. That's right, I shall grant you eternal life. I will give you the pain endlessly waiting for a beautiful world and finally to be built. The hell? Draven, Shana, let's get out of here! Oh damn. Oh uh, damn.
God damn, this guy was a... He was a trip. Whew, I'm, glad, I'm so glad that you're all safe. I really appreciate, or I really respect the courage and kindness that you all showed. Thank you, we're all fine. Are you guys okay, Tierno? Yep, as you can see, we're doing great. Thanks for asking. We worked together to save Pokemon connected to the stones at Route 10. I mostly left battling with Team Flare to Senia and Dexio, though. Who are these Senia and Dexio you speak of? We're the max, we're the masked heroes. Don't worry about it, Tierno. We were all doing our best so we could stop Team Flare's plans. Oh, we have a little bit of news for you all. We managed to destroy the machine Lissandra's lab was trying was spying on uh, people's uh, Holocaster transmissions. So we don't have to deal with Team Flare anymore. Now I can go back to filling up my Pokédex. So it's finally over, right? We can go back to on our, on our adventure, right? Let's go back to Anastar City and start over from where we left off. Okay. And well, the girlfriend right here is waiting for us. She's like, "Thank you, Sensei." I have so much respect for you as a friend. It's because I respect you that I want to beat you in battle as my rival. I really mean it. She loves me. <laughs> oh, wait, hold on. A long, long time ago. A very long time ago. The man made an ultimate weapon. Using it required life to for the life force of many Pokemon. The Pokemon granted eternal life and learned this. The resurrected, uh, the resurrected eternal Pokemon left the man's side. The man was surprised and sad. He had revived it so they could be together. Day after day had passed, but they, were ne they would never meet. Eventually he became a mere shell of a man. A man condemned to wander forever by the light of the weapon. And a Pokemon that also wanders eternally. Where is it now? What do I have to do to meet it? Oh, damn. Very sad story right there. Anywho, guys. Look at that. We made that. That's right. That's how badass we are. Anywho. So that concludes our little adventure. Legendary adventure and all that stuff. Yes, we do have Xerneas on our team, but we are not going to be using this guy on our team. It was just for this one special occasion. As you can see, Xerneas, the fairy type Pokemon, it is a tank of a Pokemon. It's special attack. It's very awesome. It does have Fairy Aura, which powers up each fairy Pokemon's fairy type moves. And, well, very bashful and all that crud. It's a very, very good Pokemon. But we will be uh, putting it on our PC. It's going to be a fun, fun thing, guys. So, uh, again, thank you guys for watching. I will see you guys in the next episode, which will we, be con oh, we will be concluding our adventure, going into the next city, getting our final badge, and then so on and so forth. We are very close to being done with this walkthrough, guys. Believe it or not, <laughs> this walkthrough has been uh, rather quick. Really, really quick. So, again, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time.